What's up? My name is Rich and I'm about to show you guys how to make more t-shirt sales. Not the how to make your initial sale, but let's say you're already going, you're already moving and you need to make more sales. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Um, this is one method that I use and I just put on my Wacom tablet. Is that how you say it? Wacom? Wacom? I don't know. I haven't used it in a while and I kind of suck at drawing, but let's give this a try. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Here we go. All right, so let's say you have a t-shirt design, right? So let's say your t-shirt design is, says, Chess King, right? Chess, like the game. And this is your winning item. This is your winning design. Let's say you had a whole bunch of t-shirt designs. Let's say you had a farm of designs. So each seed is a t-shirt design. So this one right here is your winning design. This one right here. So it grew a little leaf. Is that a leaf? Doesn't matter. It grew a little leaf. So we need to water this one. Um, this one design. I don't know where I'm going with this. So we need to water this one design, right? So how do we do that? How do we build more cells out of this? These are the, these little seeds right here, shirts that has like one to two or three cells. And then this one right here, you're getting like a hundred cells per month. So we need to transform that into more cells. So the more we water that, it's gonna eventually turn into a tree because we're running ads on it maybe. Maybe it's just a hot item. We're throwing it on all kinds of marketplaces. There's your hundred uh, selling per month design tree. Uh, so it wasn't a leaf, it's a tree. <laughs> um, so how do we branch that out? So instead of just chess king, um, what we're going to do is create like five to 15 different uh, variations of that same exact design. Since we know that design is selling, we're gonna turn it into more designs. We're gonna make one that says chess king, that's a script font up top, and then really bold in the bottom. That looks just like the first one. Well, let's say, we add an actual design to it. We add a crown on this one. Um, we make another one with the actual chess piece. That's a king. I don't even know what the king looks like in chess. I think something like that maybe. And then you put chess king in it. So now you have two other designs of the original one. Sometimes people go on the marketplace or search for your shirt and they just don't like your design, so they purchase someone else's, but they still want that same exact text. So we want to supply them with multiple different variations of that same exact design. Uh, most of the time, this works more so on marketplaces than it does on your standalone Shopify store. Because if you do it on your standalone store, you kind of look spammy doing the same shirt, unless that's your exact brand, it's just that niche itself. And then I'm gonna get into that. So not only that, we'll do stuff like, um, chess queen we can do queen we can do how you spell queen um i don't know that's chess queen okay and then we can do other stuff like chess pro you know you got to get a little more creative i'm just kind of running out of ideas right now um chess i don't know chess bro chess sister <laughs> um king of chess and then you can just start looking at stuff at chess um, so basically every single other design is going to start being a branch off of your original idea And then if you can get more and more sales out of just that one original idea You have an entire tree of designs. And I just spit everywhere. So then you have your niche So this is working in reverse a lot of people on the internet says to find your niche and then run ads uh, make designs for that certain niche and start selling instead this way um, you're flooding the marketplace with a particular um, shirt and then you're waiting until it gets sales and then you're expanding into that niche. So instead of finding a niche, we let the niche come to you. So I hope that makes sense to you. And then all we do with this niche is we can do one or two things. We can just keep on uploading it to different marketplace or we can turn this entire niche into a Shopify store or we can just keep these sales going and we can just keep on planting more seeds of different designs. And hopefully eventually we have a whole farm of t-shirts right so that's how we do it so that's a very simple yet effective way of getting more t-shirt sales i hope that makes sense if it did hit subscribe and i'll see y'all next time